this is AI coding tool tier list. First, we have GPT-4. It will go in pro tier. It is great for coding, help debugging, and brainstorming, but it lacks IT integration. Then we have a GitHub Copilot. Um, it will definitely go in elite level because of its integration with GitHub, and, and also it integrates well with VS Code. Um, then we have Bolt. Bolt will definitely go in hobby tier. So it's, Bolt is ideal for hobby projects, simple but effective and quick coding. Next, we have Kite. Kite is old school assistant. Um, it was great, but it is now overshadowed by modern tools. Then we have V0 by Vossel. Uh, V0, I'll again say, is a hobby tier. Uh, it is very lightweight, and the only problem is that it has very limited features, and it's better for simple or smaller projects. Then we have Codium. Codium will also go in hobby tier. Codium is a solid option, but it does not match the refinement of higher tier tools. Then we have Replit Ghostwriter. It will go in hobby tier again. Um, so Replit is, again, ideal for hobby projects simple quick effective uh, so then we have claude so i'll move it to proteum uh, it excels in debugging and complex lo logic tasks required for big projects so definitely proteum then we have tabine so it's a very enterprise tool so i'll just move it to so i'll move it to elite tier so it's excellent for secure environments and it's generally a enterprise focused tool uh, finally we have cursor and uh, i'll move cursor to god tier the reason for moving cursor to god uh, tier is that is great for debugging, refactoring, and seamless VS Code integration. So you can integrate using VS Code. You can commit your changes on GitHub. You can do a lot of stuff with Cursor. So this is the final tier list of all the AI coding tools. If you have any uh, suggestion, please let me know. And please do like, share, and subscribe the video. Thank you.